Hey guys, so it's been a while since I've vlogged, uh, about two weeks, um, during which time I posted a vlog basically saying that I made a decision to suspend my studies, uh, my third year studies at university. I decided to take the pressure off myself, uh, decided to focus on getting myself better to a better place. Um, I'm trying to think, uh, what's been going on? Um, so, I'm no longer in uni. Uh, I've suspended my studies. My suspension officially went through. My mitigating circumstances officially went through. I've just put in another set of mitigating circumstances for effective performance for my module I completed last term and my dissertation, um, which I also completed. But I feel like my academic performance was affected because of the chronic anxiety and everything that was going on in my previous household and moving home and loads of different things happening uh, it wasn't great so I put that in today and I'm kind of hoping that that mitigating circumstances gets approved um, but fingers crossed who knows um, I'm guessing I passed my dissertation I, I don't really know we find out our grades next Monday but I don't really know if I want to know at the moment I'm kind of feeling like I need to disassociate from uni and the grading criteria and not focus on that for a while because I think I will beat myself up if I haven't done as well as I had hoped um because I really struggled with actually writing it. I'm amazed I even submitted it on time. So I'm really kind of actually proud of myself that I finished the dissertation. But I don't necessarily know if I want to find out my grades. So I might just kind of not look at the results on Monday uh, when they come out. So at the moment, now that I'm not in uni, I'm mainly just focusing on drama and using drama as a therapy to combat the anxiety. Um, that's proven rather difficult um, because I just keep getting overwhelmed by everything and I'm finding social situations overwhelming and I'm struggling with concentration. My memory is really damaged, I think, or really, what's the word I'm looking for? Like really affected by the anxiety. So I have a good few lines uh, for the sound of music. So we're doing the sound of music in April. And I have lines, I have a, a natural acting part this time, and I'm quite excited but nervous about it. But I'm struggling to remember my lines because at the moment we haven't ran through that scene that I'm in. And I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna find it easier to cement it into my memory if we're actually verbally rehearsing the lines rather than me reading them off a screen or reading them off a script. So at the moment, I'm just focusing on that. I've applied for universal credit. I'm trying to sort out my financial side of things at the moment. I think once everything with the finance is sorted, I think that will be a huge relief and I can actually fully focus on healing, which is what I need to do now. I think that is my main port of call. Um, what else? Uh, I've been referred to card primary i've had a letter through for them i have a telephone assessment with them on the 5th of april which i think is next friday pretty sure it's next friday um at 10 30 and then i think i get a practical appointment after that um also been to the doctors today my meds have been upped so i'm making a vlog now because i don't know if i might disappear for a couple of days i don't really know how i'm gonna react but i'm guessing i'm hoping i won't have any kind of nasty side effects because i'm already on the medication so if the dosage gets upped i'm hoping that doesn't interfere with anything um what else um i'm currently script writing uh join the central library i'm just trying to get out of the flat and not stay in the flat kind of trying not to wallow in the anxiety uh just trying to deal with it uh doing breathing exercises also found 
um, an app called Wasai and I absolutely love it. It's great. Recommend it to anyone who struggles with mental health. Gives you amazing mindfulness techniques, breathing techniques, helps with sleep hygiene. It's just fantastic. I love it. I, I'm so happy. It's like a random 3 a.m. find when I was like so stressed out and I'm like, this is great. Love it. Absolutely love it. Recommend it to anyone struggling. Uh, the other thing, went to the doctors. I've also been put on uh, antibiotic tablets for my acne because my acne is really bad um, and I'm, I'm really not happy with it. Like, it's it's just, it's not great. Um, so they've put me on antibiotics to clear it, like, to help clear it because nothing I was doing was, like, clearing it at all. So hopefully things are going to start looking up. I'm... I'm just looking forward to healing at this point. I'm looking forward to just being diagnosed and knowing exactly what's wrong and how to combat what's wrong and how to successfully manage what is going on with me. Um, I'm also still doing uni work. I mean, I am and I'm not. I'm kind of dipping in and out a bit, so I want to stay in touch with my ideas from when I go back but I don't have that pressure of deadlines, which means I can think about things in a clearer headspace and I can analyze things and I can kind of make clearer decisions now than I could in uni. So I think my plan is basically like, I want to write my script, I want to finish writing that script, and then I want to move on to the character design. And then those characters will then become the puppets when I go back into uni. So I'm trying to kind of do all my foundational work as I call it like the foundations for my work I think now and then when I go back I literally can just move straight into CAD and design and make and then that takes the pressure off me so literally that is my life right now I just thought I'd give you a little update I'm sat in the living room currently waiting for my locksmith to arrive but he's not due for like a couple of hours like He's not here till five uh, to fix my front door because the lock on my front door is currently <laughs> held in place with masking tape. So I'm I'm really hoping he can fix that today because I can literally see myself being locked out at some point from the lock just not working. So there is that. Um, so yes. I just thought to give you guys a little cheeky update and I will see you guys soon. Uh, please subscribe if you liked this. Give this a thumbs up. Do whatever. I don't know. It's up to you. Anyway, see you guys later. Bye.